This is the one follow-up is that it didn't look like it's, it was necessarily your fault that you didn't knock it down, right? I mean, you're in the back and there's a scrum there and there's, your, your guys are boxing you. I mean, there's really nobody to blame. Right. It's just the play happening. They made a great play. Uh, he went up, caught the ball, but we we worked on it. We worked on it since then, made corrections, made the corrections we feel like we needed to make, and I feel like that won't happen again. Uh, this this game, uh, they got two quarterbacks, um, you know, Perry Orth and, and Michael Wayne. Uh, is, is there what's the challenge in you know them kind of interchanging them throughout the game and having to recognize which one's in? I feel like they're both pretty good quarterbacks, athletic. They can run around and make plays happen with their feet as well as their arms. So. <coughs> We're just going to go out there and make sure we contain both of them. We're going to attack them the same way. We feel like that if we play our football, play our defense, that we can keep them in the pocket and control them. I guess in a way, is it – because this is going to be, what, the first – or I guess you can kind of consider Drew like a running quarterback, but this is like the – Perry Worth is like one of the first true pocket passes you guys are going to face. Is that, you know, kind of nice? You're not going to necessarily have to deal with him running the ball around a lot. Yeah, it's definitely – but more fun for us on the edge on the defensive line when it's not a running quarterback. But either way it goes, we're still going to try to push the pocket, affect the quarterback in different ways. Not, I mean, not even just sacks, just making him get uncomfortable and move his feet. Yeah, Gavin Bellamy said last week when you face like those run pass options, you can't really use like your, your instincts as a defensive player. I don't know, what, what did you think about that? Yeah, it's really you have to make sure that you play your technique and keep them in the pocket, keep them contained because Running quarterbacks like to look for little creases, the smallest crease, and they'll hit it and start running around. And then def defensive backs lose their key, lose their eyes, and then it's just a big mess. So, I mean, when it's a running quarterback, you got to really make sure that you focus on technique. So when you're facing more of those pocket passers, what type of instincts do you think he's talking about? Um, just like being able to feel the quarterback. It's the same way with the running quarterback. You gotta, you gotta understand where the quarterback is and um, perspective to yourself and pushing the pocket, so you can't get pushed by just basic things. I don't know.